Hi guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today I've got news that you would probably enjoy and it has to do with motion library. And the motion library I'm talking about is uh, something that is coming from a company that maybe you've heard of this company before, but I have and I have used their product, which is a great and an amazing product by the way, and it is called Rococo. And Rococo has been uh, a motion capture solution company that uh, started making waves sometime last two years and last year and i was fortunate enough to have my hands on the suit which is an amazing suit and the feedback from these guys has also been great as well you know i mean when it comes to technical support and all of that stuff they actually deliver today we are having some news that simply has to do with rococo creating motion library for maya users and if you've been following up Rococo, you would probably have seen their motion library that they created for the Unity store, which means that if you're making use of Unity and let's say you have an FBX file, you will be able to go over to the Unity asset store, get the motion library and also integrate the motions with your Unity characters. And now they're bringing exactly that same solution. For now, we don't know how much motions are coming in. From the post, it seems that it's going to end up being a lot. Maybe it's going to outweigh the ones you can find on Mixamo, uh, on the Carnegie Mellon University, and some other websites as well. But for now, we don't know how much they say they have. They are only saying that it's going to be in the thousands. And this is something that you would really love if you're into motion capture and if you're making use of Maya. Needless to say, once this is available in Maya, you would probably be able to export those animations from Maya into apps like Motion Builder, Blender, and 3D Studio Max. One of the things that was also demoed was a plugin. The plugin exists inside Maya. The plugin runs directly inside there, so you can get your model, you can test out your model, you can test how the animation plays with your model. The same thing you can do with Mixamo before you download it. Links is going to be in the description in case you want to go over and see the blog or let's say you want to register so that you will be the first to know once this is available. I would like to know what your comments are. Right now, Autodesk is beginning to shake hands with this company and you know we all have presumptions and fears that might be that sooner or later, Autodesk might acquire this company just as they do with other companies that they have handshakes with. I don't know what you guys think about this. Is this a future for Maya users? Is this the death of Motion Builder? Is this a future for this company? Do you think Autodesk is gonna have plans for this company by acquiring them just like we saw with Arnold and every other app that they have actually partnered with and ended up acquiring. Tell me what you guys think about this in the comment section below and until I see you guys next time with a review, tutorial, updates, free Friday, tips and tricks, things like this. Peace.